New album? Purple Rain reissue? What? Yo, 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 what's up, people? This your boy, P. Ross, back in the building with another video. Shout out, you know what I'm saying, to all the subscribers and all the people who watch, look, and enjoy our videos. We really appreciate that. Keep on watching, you know what I'm saying? We're going to keep doing our thing. But today's article comes from www.billboard.com. Uh, this article was broke in the Purple Underground Lounge, you know what I'm saying? I saw it on... Um, Susie Soul Sanctuary dropped by uh Mikey Reese. Shout out to Mikey Reese um for dropping the article. Also, shout out to Channel Negro who left several messages on a few videos, you know what I'm saying, talking about this particular deal and what's going on with it. Shout out to Channel Negro too. Um, and we're gonna go on Prince Gaines, his catalog and landmark deal with Warner Brothers. New album coming soon great this is great this is great but if, if you really read the beginning of the article when you get to the actual article you, you get more excited the legendary order, artist returns to warner brothers records will re-release purple rain and other planned projects all right prince has returned to warner brothers records after 18 years with the deal that will see him get, regain ownership of his catalog his classic Warner's albums like Dirty Mind, Controversy, 1999 will be licensed through Warner's, Warner Brothers as part of a new global deal. As part of this deal, Prince's classic Purple Rain album will be re-released in a, in a remastered deluxe version in time for the 30th anniversary of Purple Rain album and movie. Other planned reissue projects will follow and Prince will issue a new album too. Although it is unclear if that title is part of the deal. All right, first, I'm going to say I know probably a lot of people was confused uh, due to the fact that a few weeks ago he actually uh, released Fall in Love Tonight uh, digitally, I think, through Epic Records. And I know a lot of people were saying, like, he got a record deal with Epic. No, maybe that deal was, like, for that one particular single. You know what I'm saying? Um... So, and then I don't know where the Cobalt deal at. That, 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 that deal was always a mystery anyway. So, don't know. And don't know if Plectrum Electrum is going to be the actual album that's dropped on Warners. It could or it couldn't be. You know what I'm saying? We don't know. You know what I'm saying? We, I'm kind of hoping it is, but we don't know for real. You know what I'm saying? Like, he could have inked the deal with Epic or Cobalt to release those and have several record deals. Kind of like what George Clinton did in the 70s with his stuff and record companies. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, anyway, before I even get into the Purple Rain re-release, remastered deluxe version, imagine, you know, when record companies tend to re-release and remaster albums from, from great artists, they tend to put extra things on them. Now imagine Dirty Mind with outtakes or live music from that era. You know what I'm saying? In great studio quality or great soundboard quality. You know, or Controversy. Or my favorite album, imagine 1999 with outtakes from that era. Like Turn It Up. You know what I mean? Stuff like that. Alternate versions of songs like something in the water Imagine that it's in great pristine quality That would be great now The re-release of purple rain Okay Still I'm not talking about the album This article doesn't specify if they're gonna be re-releasing the movie Now what if they do re-release the movie? What should the movie consist of extra? I say a commentary from Prince on the movie. That would be hot because the, the re-release they did a few years ago, Prince wasn't really involved with, he wasn't involved, I don't know why I said really, but he wasn't involved with that period. 
You know, you had, you know, Wendy and Lisa, people like that, members of the revolution, you know, they commented and talked about it, you know what I'm saying? But it would be great to have Prince do a, a commentary on Purple Rain, the movie, if it's re-released. Like, again, I, I'm just talking, you know what I'm saying? And I think that would be great. But the article doesn't specify if it's going to be a movie. That we do know that there will be a re-release of the legendary Purple Rain album. Now, what should that consist of? What should that consist of? Okay, of course, you know, all the tracks from the Purple Rain album, uh, let's say Jungle Love and the Bird, which were two hot songs, Sex Shooter, which was a hot track, uh, even Des Dickerson's My Nair. Um, along with that, I would say God, you know what I'm saying? The love theme, the instrumental. Um, possessed, which had a, a, a brief little uh, part in there when Morris was talking to Abalonia at the table. Um, what else? Of course, all the B-sides. Um, can you imagine listening to a remastered, remastered version of Erotic City? Putting that on, listening to it in the Dre Beats. Or the Skull Candy headphones. Can you imagine that? You know what I'm saying? All the B side, 17 Days, Another Lonely Christmas, Erotic City. Um, that would be nice. I think that would really be nice. Along with, let's get some unreleased material from that era. Like, like and stories behind songs that may or may not have made the final cut of the Purple Rain album and why they were taken off. I say let's do that. You know what I'm saying? Um, th th this is I I'm just so excited right now, y'all. You know what I'm saying? I, I really don't. I I'm excited. You know what I'm saying? It it this is all that. But anyway, the article goes on to say a brand new studio album is on the way, and both Warner Brothers Records and I are quite pleased with the results of the negotiations and look forward to a few fruitful working relationship. Prince said in a statement. I think everything has come full circle with Prince and Warner Brothers, you know what I'm saying? So, I think he got the deal that he wanted, again, along with his new MPG publishing deal, you know what I'm saying? He, he's in control of his publishing, now he's regaining ownership of his music, you know what I'm saying? This is an exciting time for, for Prince and Prince fans alike. Um, Anyway, the article goes on to talk about the, 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 the highly publicized beef between Prince and Warners in the 90s. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, what y'all think about this, people? Purple Rain, reissued, remastered, a new album. Prince gains his catalog from Warner Brothers. What y'all think about this, people? Prince fans, holler at me. Let me know. And I'm P. Ross, and I'm out.